Hi, I'm Gavin Beckner. And I'm Kylie Robinell, and we're from FLTV. Welcome to our March broadcast. First up is Gianni and Logan with MLB. Hey, Faith Lutheran. Today we're going to be going around campus asking students and faculty about the MLB season. Let's get into it. Who's your favorite baseball player? Mookie Betts. Who's your favorite MLB team? The Dodgers. And lastly, who do you think is going to win the World Series this year? The Dodgers. Thank you. Who's your favorite MLB player? Mike Trout. Who's your favorite MLB team? The Tigers. And lastly, who do you think is going to win the World Series this year? The Tigers, of course, man. The MLB season starts on March or April and ends around November or October. Last year, the, D- the Dodgers won it all. Who's your favorite baseball player? Luis Robert. Who's your favorite MLB team? The Chicago White Sox. Who do you think is going to win the World Series this year? Dodgers. Thank you. Wow, those are some interesting thoughts. Back to you in the studio. Hey, Gavin, would you rather have $1 billion or have no sin in the world? I would definitely have no sin in the world. Now off to Matthew and Aiden for this or that trivia. Why, hello there. I'm Matt of FOTV. I'm delighted to have you with me. Today we're going to be going around asking students and staff this or that. Now, join me. Let's go. Disney Plus or Netflix? Netflix. Uh, Netflix. Uh, Netflix. Netflix. Uh, uh, Netflix. Vans or Converse? Vans. Vans. Uh, Vans. Vans. To converse. I like to converse. It's part of the English language, so converse. Foot Locker or Champs? Foot Locker. Champs. Champs. Uh, Foot Locker. Ah, wow, that's a good one. Um, I will go with Foot Locker. Taco Bell or McDonald's? Taco Bell. McDonald's. 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 That is a no-brainer. Burger King. YouTube or TikTok? TikTok. YouTube. Uh, TikTok. Um, YouTube. YouTube, for sure. Snapchat or Instagram? Instagram. <clears throat> IG. Uh, Snapchat. Snapchat. Um, I don't have them. My wife is more into that. I do like the Instagram, I guess, photos. Yes. Five out of five people said Netflix. Four out of five people said Vans. And one person said Converse. Three out of five people said Foot Locker. And two out of five people said Champs. One out of five people said Taco Bell. And three out of five people said McDonald's. But one said Burger King. Two out of five people said TikTok, and three out of five people said YouTube. Two out of five people said Snapchat, and three out of five people said Instagram. Well, thank you for joining us. It was delightful. I'm Matt Fafwell TV, signing off. Off, 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 off. Hey, Kylie, who are you rooting for in this year's March Madness? Oh, I love Baylor. Now on to Ava and Marin with our March Madness broadcast. Hey guys, it's Marin Y from FLTV, and today we're going to be going around interviewing students and staff and seeing what they're doing for March Madness and who they think will win. Let's get into it. Do you watch March Madness? Yes. Yes, I love March Madness. What team are you rooting for this year? Florida Gators. I always root for the Virginia Tech Hokies because that's where I grew up, and plus they have a good basketball team. Ohio State. What team do you think will be in the top two? Um... Gonzaga and Baylor. It's really hard to say this year. I think with COVID, it's like a toss-up, but I always like ACC schools. Uh, Arizona and Ohio State. Does your family have any traditions they do for the final game? Uh, We just watch it with each other. Thank you. Um, we, We always fill out our own brackets, and then, of course, we watch the final game together, and we usually get pizza and watch the watch the whole game. Thank you. We make brackets and winner gets 20 bucks. Thank you. 
this year March Madness is only allowing 25% capacity for their games. March Madness includes the top college basketball teams that will compete for a championship position. Many families will fill out brackets and watch the games cheering on their team. This year, because of COVID-19, many fans will be watching from home instead of live or with many friends. Thanks for watching this section of our broadcast. I'm Erin Y, signing off. That story definitely scored a three-pointer on my list. For sure. Now on to Sophie and Brady with Bible stories. Hi, I'm Brady with FLTV. Did you know that the Bible is the number one printed book in the world? Let's take a moment to reflect on God's word. Who is God to you? To me, God is the savior and uh, yeah. To me, God is a father, a best friend, and someone who I could just look up to whenever I need to. What is your favorite Bible verse? Joshua 1, 9. Uh, my favorite Bible verse is John 16, 33. What is your favorite Bible story? David and Goliath. Uh, my favorite Bible story is the story of Abraham and Isaac. Abraham had unwavering faith in God and led his son up, and God saved Isaac at the last second. And um, I feel like um, it's just such a great connection for us uh, to know that our identity is through Christ and that through Christ um, we can do great things just like he, just like the Bible shows us through all kinds of people. Thanks for joining Faith Lutheran. Got to get back to my book. Gavin, do you think you can hit a home run? Oh, of course. Off to Peter and Dylan for middle school baseball. What's up, Faith Lutheran? This is Dylan S. And today we're going to be going around interviewing students about the upcoming middle school baseball season. Let's get to it. Are you playing for the middle school baseball team this season? Yes. No. What positions do you guys play? I play second and short. Uh, second and short. And lastly, do you think there will be a season this year? Uh, I don't think so because of COVID. Thank you. Are you playing for the middle school baseball team this year? Oh, yes. I am playing for the middle school baseball team. What positions do you play? I'm a pitcher in center field. And lastly, do you guys plan on having a season this year? Yeah, we're looking forward to it, but I don't know. The middle school baseball team is currently scrimmaging. The first game has not been scheduled yet. Because of COVID, athletes on the team are allowed one spectator per player. Are you on the Faith Middle School baseball team? Yes. What positions do you play for them? Um, infield. And lastly, do you think they'll have a season this year? Uh, yeah, I think we'll play a few games. Thank you. Hey, Faith Lutheran, thanks for watching. This is Peter Beckmeyer. And Dylan Swanson. Back to you. Who's your favorite celebrity, Kylie? Mine is definitely Sarah Paulson. Next up, we have celebrities with Wyatt and Aiden. Hi, I'm Wyatt from FLTV. Today we're going to be going around interviewing students and faculty about celebrities. Let's go. Who is your favorite celebrity? Uh, Samuel L. Jackson. Why do you like that celebrity? Um, he's, he's a good actor. If you could meet any celebrity and have dinner with them, who would it be? Samuel L. Jackson. Who is your favorite celebrity? Uh, LeBron James. Why is he your favorite celebrity? Because he's good at basketball. If you could meet or have dinner with any celebrity, who would it be? Giannis Antetokounmpo. Thank you. Who is your favorite celebrity? Kylie Jenner. Zendaya. Why do you like them? Because she's a billionaire. Uh, she's a good actress and she makes money. If you could meet any celebrity, who would it be? David Dobrik. The Queen of England. Who is your favorite celebrity? Man, I don't like celebrities. Uh, Emmett Smith. Why do you like them? Oh, he's a good football player, and I think overall he's a, he's a good person. If you could meet or have dinner with any celebrity, who would it be? Hmm. 
Mm. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Emmett Smith. Thank you. Thank you for watching, Faith Lutheran. Back to you. For spring break, Gavin. I'm going to Disney World. What about you? I'm hanging out with my friends. Now, Sienna and Jaden talk to students about their spring break plans. Hi, I'm Sienna Joy from FLTV, and today we're going around campus interviewing students and faculty about what they're doing for spring break. Let's go. Are you traveling anywhere for spring break? If so, where? Um, if everything doesn't get canceled, then we're we supposed to go to Hawaii. Disney World. I'm not traveling anywhere. I'm going to stay around in town. We have family coming in town. The kids' grandparents are coming, so I'll be spending time with them. Do you think spring break will be different this year because of COVID? Um, I think a lot of places will be closed down, so it'll be hard to do things. Uh, yes, because I'm going to have to wear a mask. Um, yeah. What's your favorite thing to do over spring break and why? Um, go to the beach, because... We don't have a lot of beaches here. Play video games. Sleep because I don't have anything to do. Go to Lake Tahoe. Spring break is coming up fast at the end of March, and people are looking forward to the time to relax and talk to their friends. Wow, that was interesting. I know I'm excited for spring break. Back to you. Thanks for watching, Faith Lutheran. We will see you next time. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. God, God bless. bless.